The five-day training workshop has brought together legal practitioners, Namibian police investigators and social workers on how to deal with cases involving victims of gender-based violence and violence against women and girls. Oshodonjupa Regional Governor's Special Advisor, the opening of the workshop, said the prevalence of GBV crimes continue to haunt the nation. He is, however, optimistic that foreign Challenge. experts from UNICEF and United Nations Office of Drugs and Crime will share skills and knowledge on how to deal and respond to GBV cases and victims. The nation is losing protective citizens. I therefore want to urge women and girls to report these offences to the police and ensure that the offenders are dealt with in terms of the law. Namibian Police Deputy Inspector General for Administration, Major General Anamari Nainda, said GBV must not be viewed as a police problem only. She said for effectiveness in combating these heinous crimes, communities and individual citizens must join efforts to create a safe environment for everyone. There is hardly a day in Namibia that passes by without reports of these violent and brutal crimes in the media. Thus, the Namibian police force deemed it necessary to establish gender-based violence protection units, which are specialized units throughout the country, mandated to prevent, detect and investigate GBV crimes. Prosecutor General Marta Imalwa explained that although laws are in place, society's moral is lost and severe sentences set in courts are not stopping many to commit GBV crimes. The laws themselves cannot make people moral. You can pass your severe sentences, but if the society has no moral, has lost their morality, it will never deter. Imalwa added that the training will help prosecutors to ensure perpetrators to face the full wrath of the law.